Hi, this is Jason from New Eyes Media and I'm speaking to Sammy from Pitium about the software that is brought to the Wearable Technology Show alongside some of the hardware reference products as well. So could you tell me a little bit what it is, please? Well, first of all, you know, Pitium is um, it's a company from Finland and we have a global footprint. We have offices in the UK, uh, US and Asia as well and four locations in Finland. And for over 30 years, we've been delivering advanced wireless communication solutions and products for public safety, for telecom, for IoT. And uh, over here today, you know, we're exhibiting you know, a wearable, wearable offering. Yeah. So we have um, quite many reference designs, like a reference design for a gateway, connected to the gateway, a reference design for a smartwatch. Yeah. And um, so. And we have uh, dedicated use cases for retail, for healthcare, for logistics. So um, it's all about having our platforms as paid, you know, part of the end customer product. So yeah. they will save some time and money in developing products with us. Yeah. So that's what Pidium is. Brilliant. Um, so tell me a little bit about the smartwatch. And I know you've got a phone in your pocket as well, if you're able to show oh, us yeah. that as well. Mm. Well, basically, this is a smartwatch reference design, and it's based on the Qualcomm Snapdragon. Yeah. And it's running, you know, Android KitKat. There's a Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. Uh, there's a lot of sensors inside, and uh, this is good for the high-end smartwatch market. So, uh, yeah. um, so, but this is not a product. It's like a reference design yeah, to be course. utilized. Yeah. And the, the product in question over here. So this one is um, a product from Vidium. So this is the most secure and strong LTE smartphone in the world. Yep. So it's, it's designed in Finland and it's also produced in Finland. So, um, and it's targeted for public safety, fire brigade, police, for the government and for other government agencies as well. So. Yeah. Um, so am I right in thinking that this is kind of on the lines of where you expect in the future of these technologies to go? Do you feel the main important factor is safety and security? Well, I think um, if you think about the wearable for healthcare, it's really about safety and security because uh, if we are sensing the human body data and putting that to the cloud, so we have to be sure that there's no middleman attacks. Yeah. Because, um, you know, you have the right to protect your information. So it belongs to you and the physician and no one else. Yeah. And on the phone side, um, if you think about the police chief, or CEO of a big company. Yeah. So I think you cannot afford that your business secrets is flowing in the wrong direction. So um, I think the cyber security is um, getting more momentum in verbals and also in the public safety. Yeah, brilliant. And um, where can we expect to see your name in different products in the future if there is any at all that we can talk about? Ah, well maybe, um, I think um, we're on the public safety domain yeah. for good, so I think you're going to see our name uh, for a long time on these products. But for the wearable stuff, I think I cannot comment because um, we're really, uh, our end customers are confidential, so we cannot yeah. disclose their names. So, uh, of course. Yeah. Well, Sammy, it was great to talk to you. Thank you very much. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you.